Hey, what's going on, Midwest Leopards? Uh, it's been a long time since I've actually made a video on a reptile. Went to the Millsville Expo, and I wasn't going to leave with anything, but my son saw this hypo male, and he wanted it. Um, it was uh, right around 200 bucks for him. It's a baby. Supposedly it was hatched a month before I got it, which was a week and a half ago, or however long, almost two weeks ago, maybe. I don't know. But... He's doing really good. He already ate since he's been here. He shed since he's been here. He was actually in the middle of shedding at the expo, and I didn't realize it until I got him home, and his shed started coming off after the humidity in the tank was all up and going, and he was able to get in some water and moving around. I noticed he was starting to shed. So after a couple days, he completely shed, and he was ready to eat, and he took a frozen thawed adult mouse right away, no problems. Um, that's what they had him on. Supposedly he ate twice before that, so that was his third meal. Um, I have him in a 36 by 18 by 18 exoterritorium with a under tank heater on the hot side and a bulb up top. I can't remember. Those are 150 waters is what those are. Ceramic infrared heater bulbs. Um, but yeah, let's look at him. He has some really good colors. Really bright red on his tail. He's just a baby, so all those colors are just popping like crazy. Yeah, I got him a, a rock hide over top of the uh, the under tank heater. Um, some driftwood pieces that my grandparents gave me that they found in Lake Michigan. They're up by Lake Michigan. Uh, I made these myself. My grandma used to own a, uh, or used to uh, run or help run a flower shop. So she does her own flowers at home, like arrangements and whatnot. So she gave me some fake flowers. And these big ones in the corner, and this big one right here, I just took off my tree. <laughs> so I've got unlimited fake plants, I guess. I could put more in here and just make it ridiculous, but I don't think I should. He needs, I'll be losing him. Won't be able to find out where he's pooped. But, uh, yeah, I got this fake tree statue here. He pretty much chills up in it the whole time. Water dish in the middle of the uh, cold side and the hot side, so it evaporates, but not too much. That way, that way he can get in the soak if he needs to do his thing. Um, a hood. I didn't get the hood. My buddy gave me this tank, yeah, and the stand. I didn't get the hood with it. I've been looking for a hood, and I looked online. They were 50 bucks. Uh, so we went to Lafayette to pick up a, a, a mouse for him, and lo and behold they had one at the last shop we went to the fourth shop they had one and <clears throat> not in there and they uh they had one in the back room not for sale so um then what the last fixture on the right side over here was not working and he asked how much they are online i said 50 bucks and i showed him and then uh he said, well, I'll you give me 20 bucks cash if you have cash and it's yours. So I took it, took it home. Ten minutes after we had it home, it was just a loose wire. Fixed it. Threw the light bulbs in. Everything's good. Uh, on the far right, I have a natural. Far left, I have a natural. And in the middles, I have UBBs. Or UBBs. Uh, they're all 13-watt bulbs. Uh, that's a UVB 100. So they don't have to have UVB, but, you know, a little bit doesn't hurt anybody. Um, but yeah, Eco Earth on the bottom, like always. I like Eco Earth. So, we need a name for him. So, if anybody wants to help with a name, that'd be great. Uh, here pretty soon, I'm going to. I knew I'd be getting back into reptiles full swing. So, this either this weekend or next weekend, I'm going to be ordering a uh, uh, a Sea Serpents 8 tub. And what are you doing? Taking the water out. You gonna change it? Yeah. Do not spill it. Oh. Grab it from the bottom. Oh. You like your snake? Yes. No. Yes. No. No. You don't want to hold it yet. 
do that in the bathroom, please. Um, but yeah, so we need some names if anybody has ideas for names. Um, comment down below. Comment down below in the video, Owen says. Huh? Yeah. Comment down below. What else do they need to do? Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Good deal. And hit <laughs> that little bell. And hit that what? Hit that little bell. What's that little bell do? Send some notifications when I upload new videos. Yeah. Bing. <laughs> Anyways, all right, yeah, guys. So if you have any ideas on names or whatever, let me know. But like I said, I'm gonna order a. I think it's an eight tub from Sea Serpents. It's for uh, sub adult boas that get up to three and a half feet or so. Uh, you can do adult leopard geckos in it. I'm just gonna do an eight tub. It's like 190 bucks, but it comes with the flex watt already recessed down into the. Uh, the boards and all that, I'm just going to get a uh, thermostat for it too. But yeah, I don't know. I might get a couple balls. I might get a couple more boas. I might get, this is a male hypo. I like to get a female moon glow and a female, uh, um, I don't know. I might get another, I might get a female moon glow and something else. I don't know. If you have any ideas on other boa morphs I should get, comment below. Let me know. Um, Maybe some crested geckos in the future. Maybe I'll skip the leopard geckos this time and try to breed some crested geckos out. So, yeah. If you guys have any ideas on videos you want to see up, if you have any questions about a setup for a boa or, you know, how often to feed them or any advice, if you want me to do a care video, let me know. All right, until next time, we'll see you later. See ya.